On their traditional territory, the Comox First Nation dancers were at the Kingfisher Oceanside Resort and Spa in the Comox Valley recently to mark the renewal of a local dining experience in the spirit of local stories and tradition. Since then, it's all been about connections and reconnections, the land and sea, history and present day. We were previously known as the restaurant of the Kingfisher Oceanside Resort and Spa. Now we are the Breakwater. The name Breakwater refers to the Royston wrecks, rusting hulks scuttled here to form a breakwater that used to protect log booms in Comox Bay. It's a familiar local landmark, seen here in beautiful yet haunting photographs taken by former employee Jesse Kavanoff. Journalist Larry Pinn has written extensively about the wrecks. It's one of those places where you could drive by it a hundred times and not really give it a second thought. So, you know, through initiatives like this, it kind of raises awareness for it and people will start to look into it a little bit more about the fascinating maritime and human history that, that is attached to those wrecks. Everybody's seen the wrecks uh, and not enough people know the story. So we are trying to tell the story and embrace the history and, and tie that into to what we do here. And what they do here is make delicious food with a focus on local, sustainable ingredients. And much of those ingredients come from right in front of the resort in the pristine waters of Bain Sound. You know, our logo is actually a trace of the view from one of our windows in the restaurant. We're really trying to embrace where we are and where we come from and bring that forward into, into what we offer. I wanted to reflect what people saw out of the window when they eat. I wanted them to taste that. More than just a name change, this event signified a renewed connection to the community. The Kingfisher Oceanside Resort and Spa is known internationally, mostly for its ideal setting and its relaxing spa services. The renaming of the restaurant is a chance to invite both the people who live here and visitors to come taste some of the best seafood and other local and sustainable ingredients Vancouver Island has to offer. Food, local beer and wine, and of course, oysters, always plentiful here. Breakwater right now is taking uh, our Komogoi branded oysters and our Komogoi branded manila clams. It's Good. nice that the local product is making it to the local customers and it's local dollars circulating here within the valley. Breakwater's executive chef, Philippe Gagné, believes in local and sustainable ingredients, but also simplicity. Even if we serve a simple thing like a burger, I wanted to make our own ketchup or make a different mayo. So by smoking the garlic, adding it to the mayo, it gives a bit of a of a special touch to it that's fairly simple and I think a lot of great things have been realized in food by a really simplistic approach, not necessarily always so complicated. Above all, the breakwater creates a new connection between local residents and visitors with the Comox Valley's history and abundance of food from land and sea.